All right, that's how we start off our three mile. Let me keep it recorded all the way. It says I only got 29 minutes. So we'll see how far we get before this video cuts out. Come on, let's go, let's walk, Jane. Come on, Jane, let's walk, come on, let's walk. Ready condition is pads before we left. This pavement's not so great for their feet. But when you're in the city, you gotta fucking maneuver like it, you know? You gotta, you always gotta be prepared. shut down due to the virus still cars out though there's a food bank for my city let's go boy he's been hiking his leg for the last couple months now this way Oh, this way. Come on. This way. We just stepped up the house, so he's all over every scent and smell. Uh. People walking their dogs off leash. Let's see how this works out. Those are pit bulls. People be calling the cops. Hey, your dogs are all right, right? Yeah, of course, yeah. Is that one bite? No, you're just a puppy. Yeah, that's pretty cool, spring loaded, huh? Yeah, so he don't choke himself. Right. Oh, he's nine months. Aww. All right, come on, Jang. Let's go. Let's walk. Good boy. Come on. No. Come on, Django. Let's go. Come on. <laughs> Come on, Jang. Let's go. Come on. Let's go, Jang. He's ready. He's always ready. Come on. Let's walk. Come on. Let's walk. Come on. Let's go. Let's walk. Come on. Let's walk. Come on. Let's walk. Come on. He's always quiet. When we hear a peep out of him, you just see him grab. That's how I like my dogs. He's not a real barker. Like, he'll bark, don't get me wrong, but you don't really bark at other dogs, you know, the minute the dog, like, he's comfortable with other dogs, but the minute the dog some, does something he don't like, he'll fucking grab him. Oh, mama feeding you that mush, huh? Yuck. Tell mama stop giving you pogo's food, huh? Tell her stop giving you pogo's food. Come on, let's go. Come on, I know this to other dogs. Come on, let's walk. 
Go to the park and I'm gonna cut you loose. Gotta clear up some fucking video space. There's no way I can cover four miles in one video. See if you ever come across people with their dogs loose like that. And you're not really sure if your dog's attitude, you know? Your dog will let you know. You know? And God forbid if anything was to happen, as long as your dog is on leash and their dog is off leash, you won't get in trouble. You know? Your dog can legally fucking tear their asses up. Especially if you watch video recording like I'm doing right now, like their dogs would have fucking my dog would have just bit them out of nowhere unprovoked. My dog would still be in the right because he's on a leash. You know? Now if it's the other way around, I'd be a bad owner. Just because I have a pit bull. You know, it's just little things like that we gotta look out for as guardians to this fucking amazing breed. You know, that, that, that's what I'm gonna start saying. We're not owners or parents, we're guardians. You know, we're here to make sure this dog has a future, make sure this breed doesn't go extinct like many great dogs before them. You know, like the German Bulldog. Not even a German Bulldog, German Mastiff. You know? Which got recreated into the Rottweiler. Or something like that, you know? Not a fucking professional, but something on the lines of that. Like I know Rottweiler was developed from one female from the city of Rottweil and it, cr it crossed it into some Swiss mountain dog and Burmese mountain dog with that last specimen of that German master breed to recreate the Rottweiler you know but other people will say different You know, I know there's people out there who think Pitbull came from Staff. Staff came from Pitbull. Honestly, they, they started off as the same dog. You know, but then they separated them by standards. So as the AKC continued, they wanted to separate themselves from blood sports and like what is it called, uh, commoner entertainment, you know, peasant, peasant, peasant stuff, you know, because they thought they were the upper echelons of breeders, so they wouldn't deny the animal because it was so impressive, so what they did was fake the funk and just change the name, oh no, these aren't these barbaric creatures they call American pit bull terriers, these are called American Staffordshire Terriers. Much, much, much different, you know? So all they really did was take the curs out of the game pits. All the curs, all the shit dogs went to the AKC, you know? And if you pay attention, look closely, they did that. It's the same thing that they did with the bullies. The same exact thing they did with the bullies, you know? They made the bullies because they didn't want 
the pit bull. They didn't want. They wanted the pit bull, but they didn't want its aggression or its willingness to take animals down. You know, they just wanted a people-friendly dog, but to look like a pit bull. Like, it's like buying a pair of roller skates, taking off the taking off the wheels and wearing them as shoes. You know, makes no fucking sense. Makes no sense. Why would you buy a pair of roller skates and wear them like shoes? Why wouldn't you just buy a pair of shoes? You know, but that's neither here nor there. That's that's just the mind of the capitalistic fascist minds of a lot of people in this country, you know? Everyone's all about things and materials and the next fad, the next craze. Next greatest thing, you know? And to forget, it takes decades, even centuries, to create a fucking animal this great.